Just assessing normal range of motion um, in the neck at the moment. So we're just going to get you to drop your chin down for me. Does that feel tight at all? No, that's okay. Great, and come back up again to the ceiling. Does that feel tight? Just slightly there. Yeah, okay. And can I get you to bring your right ear down to your right shoulder slowly? Okay, and back up again. And down to the side. Okay, and forward again. It feels tighter on that left hand side. Mm. I just get you to turn your head to the right for me this time, please. And to the left. Good. And just drop your chin down slowly, please. That's great. Thank you. Come on. You got a slightly rolled forward position from being on the computer quite a lot as well. So this is just some simple soft tissue, okay, to try and reduce the sensation of stiffness and soreness for the patient, okay, and to try and restore a little bit of movement through that left side. Is that okay? Yes, fine, thanks. Good. Just shout a bit sore. Okay. Is that enough of that? Mm -hmm. Good. Yeah. Good. Are you okay with that, Liz? Yeah, fine. Good. Part of our strategy is using the limbs, just like that, relax, please. Good as a long lever to get to the tissues that attach to the spine. So you can develop quite powerful movement into the little muscles that run off the side of the spine by using the limbs and the legs as long levers to get to that. And just let that relax. Good. Is that okay? Yeah? Perfect. Good. By having the patient lie down and being able to introduce the fingers into the small little muscles at the base of the skull. You can apply a direct pressure to those and provide a little bit of traction to the neck. And that's a lovely technique to use in somebody who has to hang their head in getting to a computer. You okay with that? Yeah, fine. It's also easier in this position with the patient really relaxed to get an idea of mobility in the vertebral segments of the spine. You okay with that? Yes, thanks. Good. A little bit tight in those upper right. Mm -hmm. I want your hands on top of mine, please. That's all right. Bring your chin down for me. Squeeze your elbows together. Good. And look up for me. Nice and relaxed. Squeeze those elbows. Good. You okay? Yeah. Excellent. Chin down. Good. And onto your back. So what I do in practice then is I check the ribs. Put it off the thoracic spine. Okay, so I'm just going to put your arms to here. Right. And just let those elbows come together. Like uh, yeah, yeah, it's okay. always there. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So we can do a little bit of manipulation too, but so it's amazing how two extra bodies shorten up the room. <laughs> Great. So the angle of the rib is a little tender. Okay, so a technique that osteopaths can use is a little bit of manipulation and adjustment of that. Okay. So what I want you to do is nice and relax there, Liz. Big breath in, and dodge. Well done. You okay with that? Yeah, fine. That's excellent. Come back up again, please, and sit forward. Good. Do you change your chest? Yeah, lovely. Great, and back up again, all the way up. Does it feel a bit easier? Yes. Excellent. That's it.